And my friend Sam here, so I made this 3D print, filled it with silicone, and I'm going to use that mold to show how tourniquets treat uh, the tissues and vessels underneath. All right, so th this is the type of silicone that I use, Dragon Skin 10 NV. And the truth is, it is a higher durometer. This is not a great representation of a leg, but it does show that tourniquets don't squeeze in a symmetric fashion, or at least not the windless or ratcheting type tourniquet. And the conclusion I get from that is, it matters where you place the windless or the ratchet. Um, I think probably you want it to be closer to the vessel because that's the side that seems to get the most crunch.